this is John Young with the Disc Jockey News and Disc Jockey News TV. Tonight, in this little show I'm going to do tonight, I'm going to be introducing a, a series of shows we're going to be doing over the next 10 weeks. Every Monday night for the next 10 weeks, we are going to be doing a, a starting your DJ business uh, for those who are wanting to get started in this. Now, if you've been in this industry for a long time, these are probably not going to be the shows for you. Although we are going to cover some information for some of you and some of the business things are going to have interest if you are going to be retooling for 2021. But it's going to be a lot of the basic starting out things because generally when people are starting their business, they don't know where to go and what to do. And we're going to break this down into uh, 10 different little mini courses uh, coming up here for the next 10 weeks. So this is just the intro night and I wanted to kind of go through and explain what we're going to be hitting uh, as we move forward in our process here. So we're going to pop over so that way you've got a visual it makes it a little bit easier here uh, for what we're going to do. Uh, so we're going to be doing this each Monday and each week I'm going to have a guest with me that's going to be kind of an expert in that area. So there's going to be some some topics in here. You're going to uh, see our friend Jerry who just we just finished a, a video with Jerry Bizzotta, uh talking about the finance, uh, the finance programs that are going on right now. If you are a small business, self-employed person, sole proprietor, you got to watch tonight's show uh, because if you haven't taken advantage of some of the things that are out there, they are still there and you can deal, you can maybe help get some money to get you past um, this, this downtime within our industry. That's about all. Go to uh, youtube.com slash Disc Jockey News. You'll find it there. Facebook page, Disc Jockey News Facebook page. It's there. DJ TV Facebook page. It's there. Um, so we're going to be starting our, our show here. Our right, shows starting next Monday night. So our first one is going to be May 18th, and we're basically going to be doing, you know, looking at the concept of will a DJ business or a photo booth business or any types of business will that work, and what do we need to do? Now, a lot of what we're going to be talking about is based on this reality that has happened to us here from this COVID uh, situation, and how that will affect some of the different decisions we're going to be making, and of course, as the research uh, for the success, potential uh, projecting the success of a business. So we're going to be digging into that, uh, really the research behind knowing if it's a good idea or a bad idea. That should be the title. Is it a good idea or a bad idea? But that'll be May 18th. Then we're coming back May 25th, which is Memorial Night. We're actually going to record it and it will go live um, at nine o'clock that Monday. Uh, looking at the different types of business models, the pros and cons for each one. That includes sell, uh, sole proprietorship, uh, which a lot of us are, uh, LLC, um, S Corp, C Corp. We're going to look at all of those and which one's going to be the best. Now, information on some of these has changed. If we'd have been doing this six months ago, three months ago, there are some recommendations we'd have made at that point in time that we're not going to make now. So this, for those of you who are established, if you're self-employed right now, this might be a really good show because you may decide that there's some things you need to change here this fall or this summer with your business as we go forward. So that will be coming up uh, on uh, May 25th, that particular night. The following week on, on uh, June 1st, we're going to be talking about some of the legal, legal things. Let me make sure. Uh, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. Okay, we're we're just checking, making sure all my chat chat room's open. Um, June first, we're going to be talking about the legal stuff. What do you need to do to make your business legal and to have you know with the state and everyone, the federal government, everyone basically is okay, so that you're okay with all of them. What do you need to do and and such? We're going to be digging into that June first, um, so that way you are a legitimate uh, good business. Then we're going to come back June eighth. And then we're going to basically uh, what we need to do for creating a business plan. And we're going to this is going another area that's going to be tweaked a little bit now as we are beyond the or into that COVID situation. Uh, the business plan concept of how to develop one. I've done shows on this one, and there are things that have changed since then to now. So we're going to be discussing that and going through and outlining what's involved with the business plan and how it would be tweaked and changed just a little bit. We're going to come back then the following week, the 15th, and we're going to talk about financing your business and what is out there, how to do it, uh, what that business part, uh, business plan part of financing looks like, that what is the bank, what are the bankers uh, looking at? And as you probably are hearing me talk about some of these, you're like, okay, I'm going to see Jerry that week. Yeah, I'm going to see Jerry that week. Yeah, there's going to be Jerry's going to be with us on a few of these, a few of these weeks, but that'll be June 15th where we're going to dig into the financing side of, of your business. Coming back June 22nd. 
Uh, we're gonna look at pricing. Uh, you know, what types of things, sh services should you offer? What kind of things should you offer in this? Again, this is different now because of this, this COVID world that we live in and how things are going to go. We're gonna talk about what are 2021 offerings, how they might be different than what we offered in 2019, our, our late 2020, whatever. Um, we're gonna dig into that and figuring out a little bit about how we should price things, which there's some strategies that have changed. <laughs> we did, I, I did most of these shows here back in, in probably January, February, and it's amazing how much has changed since then. We're gonna come back again June 29th. Uh, we're gonna wrap up the first month of summer. And we're going to talk a little bit about office and home office and, and where you should locate your business and renting property and, and different things such as that and how that has, <laughs> broken record, how that has changed here in the last couple of months. Um, many things have, have happened that have will affect this. This information is going to be completely different than we would have given you <laughs> two months ago. Gosh, I'm sounding like a really bad broken record. Uh, July 6th, we're going to come back and talk about uh, the people you need to have. Some people, you will, you might be employees. Some people, it might be independent contractors. Some people, it might be uh, professional services you're going to be hiring out or you need to be able to hire out. We're going to talk about the team that you need to assemble uh, to be able to run your business, run it efficiently, effectively, and securely. And we'll be de dealing with that on July 6th. Then we're going to come back on the 13th. As we continue on here, getting to, I believe this is week number nine in our our uh, our, our week or our project project. This is going to be a bigger show because we're going to talk about promotion, marketing, uh, things you can do for promoting your business, how you can market your business, and how you can develop your brand. This could be one of those shows that becomes multiple shows because we might break this down even even tighter. We may do a whole week on this, hitting Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday night. Uh, we're going to see how this all comes together, and I've got some guests. I'd love to have three different guests covering these topics. So this is week nine's topic, but it might be the topic for the whole week of July 13th. Then the final week, we're going to be talking about um, you know getting your gear, uh, finding vendors for the, supplying the things that you need to be a, a professional, legitimate mobile DJ. And then, of course, we're going to talk about some training avenues and what's out there and how you should handle learning and growing. You've got some. You've got some knowledge. You've got some skills that you picked up from watching videos and doing some YouTube. How do you go to a, a more advanced level? And we're going to be talking about all that aspects on uh, the week of July twentieth. So, th this was a really quick video. I didn't want to spend a ton of time on this tonight. I really, I really wanted to get get some of this information out there in a quick little thing so you guys can be kind of planning ahead for the weeks um all of these will be on the uh, mondays at nine o'clock some of these will be most of them will be live there will be a couple that will be pre-recorded just because of of us being out of town or or what have you or you know memorial monday i don't want to uh guarantee that i'll be if the if it's the campfires are going i'd rather be hanging out at the campfire no offense but you know with the kids or it's going to be a great summer of uh, educational stuff, but it, this is gear, going to be geared for those who are kind of starting out. That's really what we're aiming for here. And then for those of us who have been more experienced in this, there's going to be some of it, it'll be like, you know, yep, know that, yep, know that. A lot of it will be. Well, we're going to tweak some of the information to be more effective with what the situation is right now in the world and looking ahead into later 2020, 2021, and how that's all going to come together. So hopefully those who are starting will be able to use this as a primer to become more effective and jump into it at a, at a, at a more profitable level. And those of us who might be needing to retool, this could be great, uh, a great tool for us to be able to say, hey, this is something I need to fix. This is I need to change. Or it might be a thought process that, that might need to be tweaked within your business and within how you're operating. So uh, again, starting next Monday at nine o'clock, I hope to see you uh, on our Monday night shows. Um, in about at the top of the hour, at the top of the next hour, so at 10 o'clock Eastern here, Dan and I are gonna be getting coming back here uh, live with you guys tonight. And we're gonna be talking about about reaching out and connecting digitally with other vendors and uh, specifically venues and such and how how you can do that today and and what things you should talk about, what things you should be talking about, how you can present this. We're gonna dig into that tonight and get some input from a lot of you out there who have been doing this and what you've found successful and what you have found to be not so successful. And we'll be talking about that starting at 10 o'clock tonight, uh, 10 o'clock Eastern. And then of course, after that, the DJ and TV chill room will be open, djntv.com slash chill, where you can basically go and hang out with other professionals in the mobile entertainment industry. And that all is coming to you starting here in about an hour tonight. Thank you again for watching. This is John Young with the Disjockey News.